Why y'all be doing that? Why y'all be putting the SS's and stuff on y'all cars? Y'all ain't got the SS. Why y'all put the SRT on y'all cars and y'all ain't got the SRT? Y'all need to stop that. We hustle daily. What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Big Play Ray, coming to y'all with another auto video. Today, we are going to uh, IAA. I didn't even really plan on going over here, but I was over here. Uh, so I decided to come so you know check check them out and see what they got man uh, um, we gonna see what they got but if you haven't already make sure you like comment subscribe make sure you hit the notification bell to join the hustle nation greatly appreciate every single one of y'all man greatly appreciate y'all man make sure y'all follow your boy on Instagram at wehustledaily.co that's my Instagram and make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com if y'all wanna learn how to do what I just did earlier today, which was big play ready selling cars in the day, you know? So if y'all want to learn how to sell cars, especially in the day, make sure y'all go to WHD Academy, man. Because I'm showing y'all everything I know and how to do it. You know what I'm saying? I'm showing y'all everything I know. Oh, we got a stop sign. Got some traffic. But, uh, yeah, man, so make sure y'all do that. I got two packages on there for y'all. Y'all who trying to learn how to buy a car from a private party. And y'all who want to learn the fuel curriculum, y'all y'all want to learn all my tips and tricks on how I buy cars, all the games, the auctions play, stuff like that. You know, the whole nine. I'm showing y'all everything I know on how to buy and sell cars, you know. So I got the basic package and I got the full curriculum package. Full curriculum, all my tips and tricks, that's the basic package. I'm showing y'all how to pick out a car. You might want to try to buy a car offline, you know, off one of the websites for your mom, your brother, your cousin, your daughter. It don't matter. I'm showing y'all how to pick out a car. But I ain't going to talk y'all ear off. I'll see y'all when we get in IAA to see what they got today. All right, finally made it IAA 2012 Chevy Traverse. They got 625 on it right now. Got 148 on the miles. Make sure I don't run into no spider webs. See what we got. It look good. Oh, Traverse. It'd be kind of hard to get some good foot this year because uh, the cars be so close, but got a dent in the door as y'all can see oh sorry don't lay that down right there i'm sorry sorry but yeah man y'all see it smell kind of kind of weird in here 2012 tell you one thing it's hot out here though I'll tell you that much man they ain't got nothing to cover that up it looks like um like you drop some stuff in there it's over with Let's see, man. Let's crank this up third row. Oh, I forgot to close the door. Wait, let me show y'all the front of it, too. Yeah, it look good. The body look good. Oh, wow. Never mind. I already know why I don't want this car. And hey, make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com. It ain't no game, but I can crank it up, though. got a knock when it first cranks. You hear the motor? No. So let's see what else they got, man. That's gonna be a hell to the no. Let's see. Got this, uh, they got this uh, Impala. See what this looking like. I think this is a salvage title though. I like this color on it though. Yeah, it's an insurance car, 72,000 miles with the chrome, with the red. This red is like shining right now. Y'all see that? This red, I think this is the nicest color I've seen on one of the, oh, snap. Ooh, we, I knew it was something special about the color, man. I'm like, damn, this red is hidden. This red hidden hard. Let's see what the damage is. It's an insurance car. That's it. The light. LTZ, the light. Wow, that's it. Wow. And the trim piece. Damn. What year is this? Wait, there go some pieces up there too. Hold on. Oh, there's some more to it. Hold on. That interior, man, is nice. This is the nicest interior in a new Impala. For sure, because I've seen these before. See all that 
out of there. I don't know what that's about. Maybe the airbag, but I don't all see the airbags. There's some pieces right here. Oops. Pieces. But that interior is nasty, y'all. I like this car. Black with the orange. Damn, it's over here too. LTZ, that mean a little dash go up. Look, somebody made a little smiley face. Some type of little face. No power. Oops. Uh, 2016 though. But this interior is nice though. I think this is the nicest uh, interior that they got. And of course, man, this color is really just, really just hidden. That orange and that red, it just go together. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments below. That boy nice though. All right, right next to it, we got the older body style. 2008, 243 on the miles. Wow, it smells just like piss in here. Like literally. Like somebody, it's, 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 it looked, it smelled just like somebody just stood right here and got them start pissing. Damn. They must have had a dog in here or something. Yeah, it's too much going on in here. This is a uh, this is a trash car for sure. Let's keep it on moving. We got this Acura. I don't like these Acuras. I don't like these Acuras because um, they be tripping. I, I'm not messing. Listen, I'm not messing with none of the uh, Maximas no more with the CVT transmission. This Acura with the three cylinder in it, the uh, three cylinder, six cylinder in it. I'm not messing with none of those, man, because these cars be tripping, man. But check out the uh, Suburban. What year is this Suburban? Uh, 2008. Got 150 on the miles. 150 what? Is that 150? Yeah. I don't know what that is. But it don't look like it got no power, though. This one look clean, though. Third row and all of that. These, they still hold their value for sure. These Suburbans. Oh, and that go Honda. I want to check the Honda out. Let's see. Does it have power? Man, that joint crank right up. Sound good, too. Look like check engine light gonna stay on, though. 115 on the miles, not 150. But y'all already know, like, something like this goes pretty high. They be paying, you know, something like this might run you, what, five, six grand? Well, well, 115 on it is going to more you run you more, probably, most likely, especially nowadays. Let's check out this little Honda, though. Y'all know these the ones with the, uh, these the ones with the, uh, they be overheating, they be acting up sometimes. Let's see what year this one is. 05 182 on the miles it's just the coupe the coupe version of the green one that i had sold that i had got from copart uh, see. See check engine light on on this one Eighty-two on the miles. Let's see. Mm. Yeah, I had a feeling about this car. See, all of that. Like, I'm not messing with this car, man. I be having a feeling about these cars, y'all. Sometimes I get a good feeling. So yeah, we ain't gonna mess with that, man. We got another uh, Accord right here. 289 on the miles, though. What y'all think about this? I know that 99, not that Civic, but the Civic before that. Oh man, this spider waves all over me. All over my freaking ear right now. I'm trying to get it off. 
We got the new Maxima. I ain't buying no more of the Maximas, man. For real. Oh, it smell horrible in here. And it's stick shift. Y'all know I don't mess with the stick shift. But they got the Maxima Platinum Edition. They did good on the Maxima interior, too. I like the diamond stitching. That's nice. That's real nice. Got some damage on that side, though. Y'all like this Maxima? Or y'all take that Impala over there? Me, I'm gonna go with the Impala. Because that interior is just nasty. Forget the diamond stitching. I just like the color of that Impala. The exterior and the damn interior. That red is hidden for real. 62,000 miles on this, but y'all see it, man. This is parts car. I don't think you can rebuild this right here. That's over with. Let's see if I can find something else for you guys and girls. We got this Envoy. I think this Envoy was on my list. See them spider webs, man? Like, come on, dude. Spider webs everywhere. Yeah, they definitely added that. That is it ugly. This is ugly. Is this the car? Nope, I don't even want this. Hey. Make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com. It's a reason why I'm passing on certain cars, not even cranking them up. Y'all who got whdacademy.com, y'all already know, but let's keep it moving. Alrighty, we got some more Civics over here. This is a newer body style. Now, if you want to... Are you fucking... Look. Come on, yo. No home training. None. Hold on. I'm not done yet either. Hold on. This is an example of no home training. And that looks like piss in there. This is no home training right here. Jeez Louise. But you never know what people going through, but God damn, do you gotta have it like this? Damn. And I'm pretty sure that's piss. Oh, disgusting, yo. Oh man, we got a truck right here. Looks like it's been up north. It's got 2,000, it's a 2,000 with 214,000 miles on it. Looks all right. Y'all know the Vortex motors run. They run pretty good. Looks all right in here, actually. Trucks kind of go for a good little number. But I had got the, um, that Dodge Ram for a good number a while back, so. See what we got right here, man. I don't think it's gonna have no power. This damn door is open a little bit. Check engine light on, low fuel. Might just be like an evap code. I'm gonna have to check this one now. Ah. Oh yeah, four eight. Yep, four eight. Four eight liter motor. You ain't got no cooling in that joint at all. That's not a good sign. Usually these don't overheat, but I actually did see one of these overheat one time. I'm gonna come back to this one. But I know what I want to come check out. Now, this one got 400,000 miles on it, boy. 439. Damn. Yeah, y'all see it. Uh-huh. And it got the wheels on it. Don't make me get bubble some wheels now. Oh, this joint 4x4, four four too. I don't want this one, but we're going to see it. 439,000 miles. Still crank up, though. Sound good, too. Had a little rattle when it first cranked up, but man, let's check this out right here, yo. Buick Century, it do not got the miles on it, but it's a similar color to Bubba. Man, they got them 20s on there, 19s or something. Yep, this one four by four. What's those? 18. So they got the 18 inch chrome wheels on that thing, man. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, but they got a towel up there. 
Oh, this one leather. Bubba ain't got no leather. What's this? Looks like a water pump. This car probably going to be trash. Usually the Buick can be trash, man. Oh, the front don't look good at all. Front looks horrible. We'll try to crank it up, though. There's the key right here. You going to crank up or what? No. No cranky. No cranky. And thought it was going to have me some wheels. Now I want to put those wheels on my car. Let's see, 209,000 miles on it. It's kind of dusty though. Why they got a, a string coming out the damn thing? Ooh, I think the AC working. We got two, 209 on the miles, 2007. Looks all right, though. Well, it's rough on the inside, but, you know, it looks all right. Damn! this wheel oh the chrome then came off that drink look at the glue right there it's plastic yeah, it's plastic oh okay that just comes off i guess i could check this one out see if it's uh, any good ac blowing cold but you automatically need another wheel we gotta see if we got a spare in here just in case Buy this boy and you ain't gonna be able to get it home. Y'all know me, whatever I buy, it gotta be able to get home now. It don't matter, it gotta be able to get home. What the hell is this? It's a transmission stick. I don't know about this one, y'all. That transmission stick and it's got transmission fluid right there. Is it for this car though? It says Ford and General Motors. Let me see if the stick is up under, is in this car. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Let me just turn this joint off. I don't even think I'm gonna mess with this damn car for real, for real. Yeah, I don't like that. Just dealt with a car. And I was thinking that was having a transmission problem, so I don't wanna deal with another one. See, fucking, is that loose? That's not even supposed to be like that. Where's the transmission fluid at? Where's the transmission stick? I don't know. I ain't gonna even mess with this one, y'all, though. That really just blew me that uh that stick and that um see like these are loose like this piece ain't hooked up to nothing right here and then this piece right here is not hooked up to nothing either. You see the bolts loose and everything down there? Can you see that? Let's see for the focus for y'all. Y'all see it? It ain't focusing. But Nah, man, I ain't gonna mess with this one, yo. It's too much going on for me. Got that Impala, I mean, Camaro SS with the stripes. Put the SS badge right here. Nice wheels. I actually like these wheels on this car. It looks all right to me. Is this really an SS, though? Or are they trying to fool me? You got the stripe. Got the SS badge. Got some nice little wheels on it. They don't want to hit the door. Nah, they fooling me. I don't see the SS on the, uh, what you call it, on the seats. Got cloth seats. 
Why y'all be jugging it? Why y'all be finessing like that? Y'all be finessing, boy, trying to make it seem like y'all got it. We ain't got it. We ain't got the SS, man. Yeah, this is not the SS, man. 149,000 miles. Got a little nice radio in it. They put the SS badge. Let's see, man. I don't think this is no SS, bro. Let me see. Wait a minute. Nah, hell no. Nah. They trying to jug. But yeah, you got some oil right there. This is a leaky little car right here. They was doing some stuff to this one. They just tried to put them a air intake on here and they thought they was on. It looked like a fake SS though. It could pass for one with the stripes and everything. It could pass for it though. But might even have some exhaust on this joint. Let's see how it sounds. It might even have some. Let's see how far they took it. No power. Yeah, man, they trying to fool me on the SS, man. Trying to fool me on the SS, bro. And check this out. Let's see. Oh, nope, that's going to be a no for that one. And they got the snorkels on this one. I think they added that, so this is just, yeah. Yeah, people be doing their thing, man. They be trying to make they give their cars a little personality. Added the snorkels on there. It don't look bad on there though. Especially because it's the short bed with the little step bed on here. So yeah, it looks good. Yeah, man. Um, why y'all be doing that? Why y'all be putting the SS's and stuff on y'all cars? Y'all ain't got the SS. Why y'all put the SRT on y'all cars and y'all ain't got the SRT? Y'all need to stop that. All right, last but not least, last one on my list. We got the Mustang on the wheels. Let's see if the uh, Mustang is trying to finesse too. No, he ain't put all them crazy badges on there. He said if you're going to be the V6, you're just going to be the V6. This one ragged out though, automatic. Damn, damn, damn. damn. Y'all see it, this one ragged out. We can't do nothing with this, y'all. Nothing, zero. So. Oops. Oh, man. But, all right, Hustle Nation, man. I think I done checked out all the cars here. I don't really see nothing I like, man. So, it's gonna be a wrap for today's video. They usually don't be having nothing at this location, but I was over here already because I just sold the car. And I decided to come out here and make another make a video. So shout out to the whole hustle nation, man. I'm gonna go on and get up out of here. There ain't nothing in here, man. Um, a lot of cars I be passing up on. Again, if y'all don't know the reason, make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com. You know what I'm saying? If y'all want to learn all my tips and tricks and secrets when it comes to buying a car and selling cars at the auction, you know, y'all be hitting me up telling y'all telling me y'all made mistakes. But when I ask y'all, did y'all did y'all get whdacademy.com? Y'all be like, nah. Well, that's why you made the mistake, man. Make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com. I got two packages on there for y'all. I'm showing y'all everything I know, man. Shout out to the whole Hustle Nation, man. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram, wehustledaily.co. And um, yeah, man, it's going to be a wrap. I'm going to get up out of here. It's your boy Ray. Big Play Ray. I'm gone. Peace.